I'm ready Adjot. to I'm ready Joseph. for Halo 3 when you guys are. Drew. Uh, I'm ready for some like. Doing the project. Some, like, big screen too, some safety yeah. project. Uh, in a lab, there should never be any horseplay because there's always the possibility of someone getting hurt. And we never want that in a lab. For example, watch this scene. Hey! Oh, oh god! <laughs> when in a lab scenario, one should always wear closed toe shoes because it is important that if anything spills on them, then nobody gets injured and we would never want an injury in the classroom. And so, watch this clip. Well, man, that is not safe. You should not be wearing those in the lab. Yeah, you, you really need to put those shoes on. Yeah, man, that is so much better. That is proper lab. That's right how here. it should be. When in a lab, it is important that if something catches on fire, then you need to smother it with a fire blanket. That way, the oxygen is trapped under the fire blanket and the fire does not spread. Hey, somebody get a fire blanket. There's fire. When in a lab, it is important to have to wear a long sleeve shirt because you reach across the table and there's a bunch of burner on, then you could accidentally get your sleeve on fire and then it'd be dangerous because you would be on fire. Hey, stop, stop, stop. You need to roll back those sleeves. You can catch it on fire. Don't drink or taste unknown chemicals because you don't know if they could be harmful to your body. And that would be very bad if we got injured because of an experience. Hey man, you shouldn't have drinks in the lab. Why? Because if you spill some something, could be, there could be a chemical reaction. So like if I hurt. spill some of this in there, like that, it could be bad for me? That would be very bad. You're probably going to die now. Oh my god. He's going to die. Oh. This man Why did you die. stop me? I, I couldn't stop you. Call 911. Call 911. 911, get an AED. Come on, quick. Hurry, CPR. What is that? Yes, call 911. Bring, bring. Yeah, I, I'm here to report an emergency. Someone swallowed a chemical in the lab because he wasn't supposed to. Now he's dying, I think. He's dying. He thinks. He, he is dead. I think he died. I think, yeah, he's, he's dead. Just... Get, don't get paramedics, just call the morgue. He's dead. So you should never drink in a lab. You should always tie back long hair when a lab because if you don't tie it back and you're working with Bunsen burners and it catches on fire, you lose your hair and uh, everybody gets to smell burning hair. So it smells awful. And it just, you know, it's bad. Ooh, fire! <laughs> whoa, Missy. That's so much whoa, fire! Whoa, 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 whoa! You need to tie back the long hair. That's really dangerous. What if I don't have a romance? Tie it back. No, I got one. Okay, okay. alright, wow. that's good. Then no, I just tie it back and I'm Yeah, good. just tie it back. So I can keep playing with it. No, don't around with it. Make sure that you put nothing over 68 pounds underneath the shower because statistics show that 69% of the population cannot lift over 68 pounds. And if you cannot get under the shower to clean yourself of chemicals, then you might die. And that would be very, very bad. Chemicals! Chemicals! Ah, oh, chemicals on my body! I can't get this! Ah! Oh, I think it weighs like 69 pounds! I can't get under the shower! It weighs like 69 pounds! It is always important to follow the instructions of the best teacher in the world, Miss Moo. Laka 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 laka! In a lab or you will blow up six to nine times in a row. Maybe I'll start pouring once you actually light the thing, okay? Not <laughs> 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 my ear. <laughs> Ow. When working in a lab 
and you're instructed to sniff a chemical that you just mixed, make sure you don't sniff them directly because statistically, chance, studies have shown that you have a 69% chance of getting brain damage if you sniff them directly. So always make sure to wash them. Never sniff. 67. 68. 69! Ah, Hey, you need to put your goggles on. How come? Because you can get something in your eye. I mean, I don't, I don't even think that's like possible. Believe me, these things are dangerous. Okay, I guess. That's proper lab. It is proper lab procedure. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for that. No problem.